I'm about to enter the halls of one of Thailand's most prestigious schools that not only encourages fighting, it teaches it as an art form. Muay Thai is Thailand's national sport. Like kickboxing, it's a form of martial arts, but incorporates punches, elbows, knee strikes, and kicks. If we thought Americans were passionate about our baseball, the ties have put us to shame. Everyone here either participates or spectates. Muay Thai is a part of the Thai's daily life. I'm here at Fairtex, one of Thailand's leading Muay Thai training schools, where anyone and everyone from around the world comes to train. <laughs> that bag had it coming. <laughs> How are you doing, Antonio? You I'm so good to see you. Nice to see you too. Welcome to Thailand. Antonio Graceffo is a native New Yorker turned martial arts expert. After the September 11th attacks, he thought twice about his life as an investment banker and dropped everything to live in Asia and study martial arts. So Muay Thai, yes. how serious is this sport in this country? It's the most popular spectator sport and gambling sport in Thailand. <laughs> so do I got what it takes? And you got the willingness? I've got so much willingness. Have you got the heart? Definitely. Okay, let's go learn. Okay. With all my heart, I'm ready to give Muay Thai a shot. So I'm going to ask you to throw some punches at my hand. So throw left. <laughs> I'm like, oh, okay. So, so I throw left. Okay. Yeah, left. Boom. Okay. Very nice. Okay. Let's do an elbow now. Bring it way up high. Come up high first. Down. Boom. Wow. That, I mean, just in that small movement, you can feel the force that is in this. If you put 20% of your body into this, you could cut me open. I'd be cut open. They'd have to stop the fight. Awesome. Yeah, so why are ties so good? You're so good because they start fighting when they're very young. There are boys that have their first prize fight for money when they're seven years old. And there's one fighter who's been at it for a very long time. So this is the guy, the professor. This is the man, a living piece of history right here. 65 years old, probably been fighting since he was seven. But you know, he does look cuddly. He is cuddly, <laughs> like your grandpa, if your grandpa could fight. The Thai king named Opde, Thailand's best kicker. He's an absolute legend and I'm honored to train with him. This is really special, you're getting wrapped up by the master. <laughs> He said that, um, that women can be very good at Muay Thai. And said, why is that? Mm. He says that the, the foreign women in America, they have, they have more heart. Oh. I always thought that uh, to be a true fighter, you had to have uh, an anger inside of you. But it seems in Muay Thai, it's more of a love. Absolutely, yeah. Absolutely not. Now, it's time to show these boys what I'm made of. Time. Okay. I just hit him in the head. He's like, good. The first time a teacher's ever said that to me. He said, if you train two more months, you'll be able to go fight. <laughs> All right. <Yeah. laughs> so feeling really good about my Muay Thai lesson. I've certainly heard about it and knew that it was a very fierce sport, so I was be very intimidated, but as soon as the master told me that it's not about having a fierceness or an anger, it's all about having a big heart, I thought, I bet you I could do this. And I did. 